Can you talk a little bit about um, birth control pills and hormone replacement? It's a huge yeah, subject. Yeah. But do they increase the risk of a woman getting breast cancer? For birth control pills, probably not. Some older studies look like there was a slightly increased risk, but there are a couple of very recent, very well done studies looking at birth control pills up until the normal age of menopause did not show an increased risk of breast cancer. So those we'll use even in people with these breast cancer, you know, um, susceptibility genes. Sometimes we'll use them, you know, for various reasons. But at hormone replacement after menopause, especially after a certain number of years, can increase mm -hmm. the risk of breast cancer. Somewhere between years three and five is when you'll st start to see an increased risk of breast cancer. So if people need estrogen replacement, estrogen progesterone replacement for a short period because of bad menopausal symptoms, that's reasonable. But we try to avoid you know years and years of that because then we start to run into the increased risk of breast cancer. Right, right. There was a time when we thought that everyone, in fact, I was in medical school, everyone who doesn't have some contraindication, right. some reason why they can't, right. should be on a hormone replacement right. therapy. Uh, when once they go through menopause, right. and we thought it was going to prevent osteoporosis, mm -hmm. uh, prevent heart disease, mm -hmm. and also the menopausal symptoms. Mm -hmm. um, and then we completely changed the way we think about things. Right. But I think a lot of people, a lot of um, folks in the community, got the impression that nobody should be on mm -hmm. hormone mm -hmm. therapy anymore. But it's important what you said, and I'm going to just try and summarize that again. Um, up to three to five years of hormone mm -hmm. treatment is okay for mm -hmm. people who are going through symptoms of mm -hmm. menopause. So if you're having hot flashes, night sweats, mm -hmm. um, irritability, mm -hmm. okay to do for a period of time. Maybe you wouldn't do it if there was a strong family history yeah, of breast cancer. If they had a high risk for breast cancer, then I usually tell them we're going to try really hard to avoid estrogen. <laughs> we'll try all the other tricks we yeah, can yeah. think of before we get back to estrogen. <laughs> yeah.